I'm ready. Yeah, man. <coughs> what, up, what up, everybody? Uh, thank you for. No, no, no. Hope you got enjoyed <laughs> Start again, bro. Let's <laughs> get into the topic. Now, we're going to start with a rap, I guess. Oh, I see the one I call it hip hop. These are. Ah, they're still laughing at that. <laughs> you'll find out why. You'll find out why. But. <laughs> I'm not telling you a straight face, but um, <laughs> if you've been hearing a lot of stories recently um, regarding Coda Black, Nelly, um, with like rape accusations, um, if you don't remember Bobby Schmider, shooting allegations while he's in jail for that to moment, we can date back to like Tupac and Biggie with the whole West Coast versus East Coast, Dre, uh, 50 Cent, the list goes on, the list definitely goes on. <laughs> so I, I guess the conversation for today is, does rap pr um, promote positivity? Or negativity. Well, you have to describe positivity or negativity because I mean, I mean, it's a yes and no kind of answer, isn't it? Mm. I mean, if you want to start, I mean, okay, I'll say my point then. Please. Um, I believe it's fairly negative. Mm -hmm. um, sorry to all my rapper friends. I know you guys are thinking right now, fun is you, but. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I know what's going to happen in my DMs later tonight, but it's only Pete. Hey, <laughs> but the reason why I say negative is you 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 got to look at the the topics. It's usually gun and knife crime or drug related. Even if you go through the social media, it's usually them high showing us their weed. Um, if you're brave enough to pop pills and camera, you're brave enough to do that. Like you only got to look at bloody Soldier Boy, for example. Um, when you had a Drake on bloody Instagram lines, they were going to sh shoot up bloody Quavo. Like, these rappers generally don't. And if you've got to think about it, most of these fans are younger. I'm looking at secondary school kids, year seven, year eight. When we was in school, we weren't spitting bars about trying to get our wifey. We were spitting bars that we were about some ish. And we weren't on noted. We ain't seen a right. strap. But man was spitting bars like, pull up in the yard, clap, clap, clap. saying I'm a slut too but in his music and if you listen to his most recent album he's talking about glap glap and pat pat you know what I'm saying like, you, you got to think about like, like anyone can Okay, good. This is fact. So if I was a rapper, 
Yeah. And I tweeted, oh yeah, I just gave a million pounds to charity. Yeah. Well, I sang about running up into some woman's home, shooting her wife and shooting her husband and her children. Which one's me? What, the false image one. The, 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 the false image one. The, 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 the one I'm the yeah. one I'm faking the lyrics. Yeah. Yeah. Instead of so you would you wouldn't focus on the, the million pounds to give to charity. You would focus about you would focus on the fake lyrics. I well, just, the violence. Yeah. Well, with me, yeah. we're gonna focus on the bad. Just fact, it's what media does. You focus on it. That's every, 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 that's, that's, a bit, that's a bit mad. People. That's a bit mad. So even is. though I would just be using these lyrics to make money because yeah. that's what you want to hear. But uh, like, but you also remember what all rappers say is they never say anything good we do. We, they always say everything bad we do. And I think what's the what the problem is the bad can sometimes outweigh the good because they'll be doing one or two good things. But like eight or seven. So even though, though this, even though this song I just made is completely fake and I've never done it, yeah, but they don't you would focus know, on that know. rather than the million pounds I just need to charity, which I literally just, but, he just did. We don't know it's fake. Rappers don't. Rappers but lie all the time. But you do lyrics. know that this is know. real, though. But so it, even though you don't know, sorry, even yeah, though you okay. don't know whether or not this is real or fake, yeah. and you know the fact that this is real, the yeah. charity I just gave money to is real. Yeah. You would focus on the the fake, the fake or real thing. I mean, but people are just, people are gonna see what you do is good, but they're always gonna go back to what you're talking about. That's right? what they're saying. That's that's what that's that's the most thing that's what's being promoted more. Like, is the badness of the music. Like, yeah, it's cause it's so easy to, like, like with, in, in what you're saying now, yeah, like, you don't know if it's true if they're bad at life or not. Most people think that that is not because we're not seeing no RIP this and that all the time. Mm-hmm. So it's easy it's easy to write fake personals and just gun bars and this and that and what you do and that like it's easy to do that now because it worked because it's worked and it's a work for the next person that done it mm-hmm. and that's the artist they must not work they want to follow it they want to follow it it keeps and it goes back generations but like and yeah. it's going to keep getting worse like mm. I, there's a lot to it like it, the evolution has been ridiculous like mm. i remember like when hip-hop had a message like yeah yeah, yeah. like i'm gonna go back to Public enemy, fight the power. Mm. Even though it's not hip hop, or uh, Tommy Butler, prison song, I'm, I'm gonna touch on that a lot because Future, he done something bad. Like, shout out to Future, but Mask on, Tommy Butler, prison song. Now, you listen to that song, Tommy Butler, Tommy Butler, prison song. Mm. It's a brilliant, soulful type song about rights and civil sort of rights, like black freedom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Metro, who produced, who produced Mask Off? Was it Metro Boomer? Was it Metro Boomer? I'm sure it was. Either that or Hitmaker. Okay, and one of them two <coughs> yeah. produced it, sampled the flute, turned into a trap beat. Future, I don't know if he wrote it, or his ghostwriter, talked about drugs. So he spoke a perfectly beautiful, uh, black, cultured, African-American song, mm. and spoke about drugs. That's what I bet. Mm. See, the Mask Off bit is cool, the, in, the, the Mask Off is calm. But this is another prime example of our hip hop come to. Like, the song playing songs now, and like, it's not relating, not the change, it's not relating, changing the meaning, exactly, yeah. it's not relating. That's one thing as well, and that kind of got to me because yeah. Tommy, but- Tommy Butler, Prison Song, is actually a beautiful song. And like, as, as more. Oh. Yeah. I mean, I do want to say, just in case everybody's Twitter fingering me up right now, yeah, I'm going to wait. Oh, you want to carry on? <laughs> <laughs> One minute. Oh, yeah, I got that. <laughs> <laughs> I do want to say, just to get everybody's Twitter through, I do understand there are positive rappers, you've got gospel rap. Um, we can go in. Conscious rap, like, you know, there's so many yeah, you've, you've got a lot, like, that's what I'm talking about there's too, a, like, there's a lot of positive rap, there's but there's not necessarily even like positive, it's still kind of negative, but in a positive way. Yeah. Like, for instance, like, fuck the police. That's not a positive message. No, but that's a pro. That's on the protest. That's a, that, that, but that is is pro, 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 it's promoting a negative message in a negative message in a positive way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like NWA. You know what I mean? Yeah, you're, yeah, you're, yeah. Not, you're not promoting goodness <laughs> right now. Like, yeah. But however, it's type of goodness you need. Mm. You need to kind of get angry about this shit. You need to get kind of you need to be aware of this. Yeah. So. I'm to do it. Yeah. Um. Wait, let's just get the ca- let the camera die after 20 seconds and we just carry on after that, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, and I wanted to make, I wanted to add a point that 
the problem is that the ones that make it tend to be the negative ones. Now, exactly. look at what, like, I had an interview on episode four was with Vic Tizzle. He's a gospel mobile winning act, but he felt like his music, he needed to come out of that scene to escalate further. He felt like gospel was stopping him from doing certain things. So, positive rap clearly isn't sellable. Because not sellable, but it's not appealing to everyone. It's exactly. appealing to a certain demographic. Exactly. What do you call it, yeah? Um, like you're saying, that, um, Vic Tizzle, shout out to him. I don't I ain't heard of him, but shout out to him. Um, yeah. He said he started off gospel rap and like, yeah. now it's positivity music. Okay, Kendrick, Cole, Logic, Khan, like all these and more other lyricists, like lyricists, mm. like, <clears throat> like positive music, talking about the old days, how they are today, yeah. not just using the music women, like disrespecting, like, just disrespect, being disrespectful to women mainly. Yeah. And um, they talk about positivity. Now when yeah. you compare it to Lil Yachty, Lil Pump, Lil This, Lil That, Famous, the Mumble Rappers, yeah, yeah, rap, yeah. all of them, it's going to sound boring. Because yeah, they're more time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, comparing the two, it's kind of unfair. Because yeah. you're not going to hear, you're not going to hear a recent Kendrick song. Well, you can now, but God, like, it's his new Kendrick, his new um, album, Dan, it's got, it's got the club bangers as well. Yeah. But you're not going to hear as much as Kendrick as you hear like Lil this, that Drake, yeah, but yeah. they've got their more turn up songs like yeah. that's much so much impact on the hip hop industry right now. Yeah, about yeah. influence on drugs, drugs, all of this and like for example Bobby Schmurda, like one hit wonder. Well oh, he's in prison, right? He's in prison, yeah, exactly, he's in prison. But um but in that era, yeah. When that song popped off like everyone used to go off in the club. Yeah. The same yeah. thing, young and made, like these kind of little one hit wonder songs that like. Well all you need is basically a viral moment. Um, I think that's what I call that, like, you know, with the whole um, Bobby Shmurda. Yeah. That viral moment was when he threw that hat yeah, in the dark. Yeah, yeah. On Vine, was when Vine was popping. On Vine, when Vine was popping, he got a viral, he, he, can even, he can even date back to the mannequin challenge with um, Ray Struman. Didn't know who the hell they were, saw the mannequin challenge, I was like, what's up with this? All of a sudden, I find it's just two guys, and you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Now no, I know who they are, do you know what I mean? It's all about viral, you got Cash Me Outside, girl. Science. Science. That's another thing. Now they're making now now industry and the media are making like silly people famous and they're getting into here so quickly. Yeah. Man. Like there's other people. There's other. That man's not hot. Man. <laughs> Stop talking. You're getting upset. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay this man's not hot, dude. Shout out to him. He's, yeah. a, he's a comedian, but yeah. pro- I've I spoke this so much times. There's pros and there's cons. He's an RS2, and they, they're comedians. Okay. They have a big, they are following the rhythm on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, whatever. Mm. So they're going to make funny videos and make silly um, parodies and that. Yeah. And obviously it will get, it will get so much exposure quickly. Like, yeah, get, yeah. like this going quickly. Like, let me use like, um, Brody Machat for example now. Yeah. He made, he made, Charlie Sloth, he made, um, his viral moment was the, um, the gun sound bit. Yeah, yeah. And there's yeah. uh, so many memes about it, like, caption this and when you, when you sign out this, blah, 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 blah. But anyways, so that went viral quickly. Mm. I'm thinking, well, how does how is lip and if this is the whole song it don't make sense because he's a comedian yeah but there's that's a pro that's that's a pro to him because he's a comedian but the cause now there's other people putting in work yeah for this he's for this. He's, all, he's making a joke and getting to where their destination is yeah. and they're putting in work and not getting in exactly yeah now you, you choose on itunes yeah there's people writing to the granite in their pencils broken yeah for a good song and they're just getting like 10, 20,000 tips on YouTube or SoundCloud. Yeah. And he's writing funny songs, gun sounds, and it's getting out. Oh, Amber Rose posted it. Wall Star, The Shade Room. So then a war makes it makes you think the academics talking about the You know what I mean? So it's like when people do come out and want to go where he's gone, they're going to go, okay, do I need to become a lyricist who talks about positivity? Or do I go, scrap that, pop, 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 all of that? And it's like, what well, do you want to do? Do you, like, at the end of the day, you need money to eat. Basically. And if the way you yeah. can get money, if I'm talking about the way this, a, a gun sounds, yeah. sure, you're going to take that road, then talking about actual topics and that things, buzz, you know what I mean? Like buzz. And then, I think it's all not, based now on popul- popularity. popularity yeah. Look at Book. He said he was a rapper, but he done his pranks and stuff. Blew off his pranks and stuff. No, he, 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 had to, he stole from the shops for his exposure. Yeah. 
Like even Little Pump, I didn't know. I, take I, care, I, know I, I didn't even know that Little Pump made music until DJ Cadenas brought him up. I was like, he does music. I know him for his prank. Now he's got a full album coming now. I'm like, what the? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's, uh, it's all viral. Even even want to even want to date back to YouTubers now. I wouldn't be surprised like, if they like they just do this just because they fucking can. Sorry, no, I swear, sorry. But just because they can. I mean, like. They just they say like a bit of a make another track because it's easy money. What it is, and it's like you that's such a that's it. such a that's, that's such a type of the phase of people who actually give give their heart and their soul into their music mm. and want to do this as a profession rather than something that kind of just you string together a couple of lines yeah. and they'll have it sell because they can have it sell. Mm. Yeah, and that's just, and that's why I don't know about positivity, and that's why a lot of people do turn to rapping about. That rather than rapping about anything else. You know, that that was Russ sells. Russ, right? I uh, brilliant lyricism, brilliant pen, brilliant performer. So that shows. He's another one. He 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 doesn't promote that kind of lifestyle. He promotes a positivity lifestyle, and he and he is against guys. He had a T-shirt, and he had a, like, a saying about drugs or what he'd done. Um, and he was on Complex too, talking about it as well. He went out. He, was, he tweeted, bro. Why do these rappers promote drugs? All of that. And, and what's like that? What's his name? Uh, one of them rappers. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Fredo Santana? Yeah, yeah, he was one of them. like three or four. Well, there were three of them, but he, but, um, he was like the biggest. Academics like, pointing at him. Yeah. And I was like, I said, well, oh, look, if you want to do blah, 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 like, typical defending, defending the people that want to slowly killing themselves. Yeah. Fredo's doing. And obviously, Russ is against that. Yeah. And I respect that. But the world, this, this hip hop industry is weak now, like, we need drug for your energy. We need these mm. pills, like, mm. they're Morpheus. One pill, yeah. to both hands, like. That's what I'm saying. It's like, odd lean, like, it's, it's, and, and that thing, well, like, it sells, little, though. It's, it's what I'm saying, it sells, because that's like, that's what it is today for the past nine, ten years, like. Mm. Do you know who Crack Lucas is? I've heard of him. Yeah, yeah he's, he's like a, another, like, joke guy, but, um, he, he's serious, he can rap, but he can rap too. Yeah. He can do parody and he can rap. Mm. But anyways, he's done like a, um, like a, a music, done, Evolution of hip hop, okay. and so he rapped like it was in the eighties, nineties, two thousand, two thousand tens, oh, and the cool. topic was the uh, the influence on drugs in these eras. Mm. So back in those days, when went drug, yeah, they used to sell drugs to get out the hood mm. to come around and stay, be positive. Mm. Then I think nineteen nineties, sell trying to do with drugs, but um, doing it trying to do depression. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Then two thousands now come in, singing about it. Now they had a crunk that when the crunk came in, that soldier by a D for L. That kind of kind of inspired that them kind of beats. I'm talking about how they do do jobs and it's kind of cool and stuff like that. Mm. Then you got 2010 now, yeah. and I'm thinking, yeah, it's cool to do jobs. It's fun. Yeah. That that blah blah blah, blah, blah like doing the videos. You show it. It's more it's more advertised now. It's more publicized. It's commercial. Yeah, yeah, it's commercial now. So the kind of evolution of jobs where he was he was talking about positivity, positively. Yeah about not doing it yeah. and from the other years it just came to like a proper like you said post like you know what? I also want to bring up um, quickly uh, talking of talking the rap scene mm. Justin Bieber Miley Cyrus when you have like people from different well they're, they're pop culture they came into rap very negative views and as soon as it got too much for them went back to their side now, Miley Cyrus came out and said, She's Oh, lucky. I don't want to do this rap stuff because he promotes drug and da 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 da. He was just making four songs, chilling with Wiz. Like, chilling free. You know what I mean? What are yeah. you doing? The days on my feet, she was like, Yeah. 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 Justin Bieber, oh, Justin Bieber never came out and said nothing, so I'm not going to. He came out with one time. Allegations. But Justin Bieber was fully black for five minutes, and all of a sudden, when it got hot, too hot, back on Ellen making all of these, like, Yeah, you know, I want to make a difference in my music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, you need to make some money. Like, come on, when the, when the, when the hip hop scene or the rap scene is doing right, everybody, everybody everyone comes, jumps on it. But unless there's negativity, they fly back. Everyone wants to be black without being black. Yeah. yeah. What do you say, three seconds? 30. Okay, cool, yeah, we'll do this. Oh, what, are you going to carry oh, on after this? Ca- no, no. Yeah, hey, no thank you very much for. Uh, if you want us to carry on this topic and make it a full half an hour topic, Comment in the section below. I reckon this man, where can they find you, bro? What's your social media accounts and all that good stuff? So find me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, 
Reckless is primo, R-E-C-K-L-E-Z-Z-I-S-P-R-I-M-O. Reckless is primo. I hope you have a pen and paper there. 100%. All will be in the description below. Exactly. below. I'll also add in a few music videos. Uh, well, that's, we just done one reason one with David Zowie, so <laughs> he's a big oh, guy, big guy. Oh, well, you'll, you'll, you'll see the I'm in a, in, a, in a Trump mask, in it. But yeah, represent to the Trump. But, yeah. <laughs> but, Represented. I'll also put a link to his side because you can hear like, some of his music as well. Yeah, I've got a lot of things coming up soon. So, Do it. Um, Click that follow button. Just follow, yeah. follow like, keep in contact, DM me, shout me, whatever. Keep an eye out to watch that space. Come to my planet. <laughs> <laughs> Aries, thank you very much for watching the show. Thank you for having me. Um, this has been Chill Chat Chill. Hope you guys enjoyed your time and we'll see you guys again in a bit. Peace. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs>